Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Stank Weasel, your neighborhood skunk in a hoodie, bringing you another regular dose of irregular content. So over this holiday season, I've spent a lot of time indoors as most of us have, not only because of the weather, but because of the world itself. And I've rediscovered a love for the game Sea of Thieves. If you've ever looked back on my channel, some of the very first content ever posted here was actually playing Sea of Thieves and all of the random occurrences and exciting adventures that you can kind of stumble across inadvertently. Much like with Phasmophobia, it's the community that really helped shape this game. Well, as we are approaching New Year's Eve and the following days into the beginning of the year, there is a couple of time-gated events that I wanted to draw some attention to in case you have recently acquired the game, thinking about getting back into it or playing catch up. So let's go ahead and take a look at those. So starting things off, if you haven't been paying attention to the events tab in game, you may have missed that every Friday night is considered air quotes Fortnite in game, at which point each of the rewards, including the stronghold loot from forts is going to actually have increased benefits, reputation and value. And now for some of the good stuff. The Golden Glory Weekend begins this evening where you will earn double the usual gold and reputation thanks to the Golden Glory Weekend where fame and fortune await over the seas, blah, blah, blah. Basically, it's money time, guys. If you have any catching up to do, you want to go ahead and grind at any of those companies, reputations, anything like that for the factions or have a massive influx of players for you Reapers out there, this is the time to do it. We're going to be inside anyways. Might as well make the most of it. But wait, there's more. Um, starting January 2nd over on Twitch, Rare with the Sea of Thieves team is partnering with Twitch to do some festive drops with some limited time exclusives for cosmetics in game. Make sure that you have your account logged in and linked for Twitch and your Sea of Thieves account, whether it's through Steam, via the Microsoft thing, your Windows, Microsoft, Xbox login, game companion thing, or your Xbox login, respectively. And once those are paired together, beginning on January 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, and 6th, if you go over to the Sea of Thieves directory on Twitch, make sure you're finding the streamers that have the drops in their titles and that you'll see the drops enabled on their stream. And if you watch for a minimum of 20 minutes a day, which shouldn't be hard, and there's obviously ways to do it without requiring too much effort, leave a browser window open, every 24 hours you'll be rewarded with a different item. So those will be re revealed as they come out and they'll be posted up on the website. I'll have a link down below for Sea of Thieves. And then we will have some more fun things to run around the ocean with, drawing way too much attention to ourselves because the cosmetics aren't particularly good for playing hide and seek. Anyway, thanks again, everybody, for all the support. Uh, happy sailing. I'll see you on the seas. I'll see you back in Phasmophobia with some more ghost hunting this weekend. And don't forget to like and subscribe. It means a world to me. The world to me as well, not just a world. I'll leave that in. Um, thank you, everyone. Have a safe, happy, and blessed new year. And may 2021 be nothing like this year.